Hi everyone, welcome in, welcome back to my channel. My name is Emmy. if you're new here, it's so good to have you here. Today we are watching Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2. So we're continuing our Marvel movies, we're continuing Phase 3, and we're continuing Guardians of the Galaxy. So obviously I've only seen Volume 1. I think there's actually only two Guardians of the Galaxy movies out, which is kind of cool to think about because I feel like I've been so behind on Marvel. But now it feels like once I watch this, I'm kind of up to speed, at least with the Guardians of the Galaxy story. I kind of like that. That's cool. It feels like I'm actually making progress, even though there's constantly movies coming out and TV series coming out. But yeah, we just got done watching watching Doctor Strange, which I loved. Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 1 really threw me through a loop. I was not expecting such like a lighthearted, kind of goofier movie when it was really in the thick of it with the Avengers. So I wonder if it's going to be kind of like that, or I wonder if since this is the second time around, it's going to be a bit more serious now. I do know I'm expecting some good music. I really loved the soundtrack of Volume 1, and I'm hoping Volume 2 is fun too. I think they really play into the music aspect of it because obviously, we know the mixtape that was given to him from his mom and volume is just usually the name for different music sets i think <laughs> but yeah i don't know i'm just excited so we're just gonna go ahead and get on into it if you aren't already subscribed i would really appreciate that of course a thumbs up is appreciated too also on my patreon i'm about four to five weeks ahead so if you're interested in early access and timer reactions you can check out the link for that in the description below all right let's go Missouri. Oh, in 1980? So perhaps this is before he got abducted? I actually don't remember what year that was. I was afraid it wouldn't take to the soil, but it rooted quickly. And soon, it'll be everywhere. What is that? Do we want that all across the universe? I'm not sure if we do. My heart is yours, Meredith Quill. Quill, okay, so that woman was his mom. And then that gives us insight on who his dad is. Mm. I don't know. Do we want this thing all over the universe? I'm nervous about it. Have we considered all of the ramifications of it? 34 years later. It's just swords were your thing and guns were mine. But I guess we're both doing guns now. I just didn't know that. Mm. Drax. Right away, the like goofy humor, and that's funny. <gasps> and Drax, our guy. I loved him. I was so sure that he was gonna die. I am <gasps> Baby Groot. Look at him. I love him. <laughs> Oh, I just know I'm gonna love this movie just because of that little fella. Are you kidding me? I can't. Look at him do his little dance. I need him and Baby Yoda in the same room. Actually, I think that might actually kill me. Groot is just vibing, okay? Nobody should rain on his parade dance. Ooh. See, he just needed someone in his own size to pick on, naturally. <laughs> and after that, he's still kicking. This is a really cute intro thing. And it's over. Oh my god. No way he's going into that. What? With all those teeth? You know, I actually didn't realize that. I thought he was actually onto something. <laughs> Ugh. God, that is gross. You know what? If we just imagine that it's like the Nickelodeon slime, then it's okay. Yeah. Just, just imagine it's slime. Everyone wanted to be slime. And you lacks batteries. Harby Larry batteries. 
Oh my god. <laughs> I relate to that too much as a first grade teacher. Trying to say something and then trying to repeat it correctly and it's just completely off. Are these people like made out of gold or what? I would be honored. Yes. <gasps> Oh, it's our sister. Hey, sis. Yeah, What's yeah, good? Yeah, 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 that's what I'm saying. A little family I reunion. She is your sister. Our soldiers apprehended her attempting to steal the batteries. Do with her as you please. What just happened? How did she get out of that chair? That was kind of cool. And your father. He ain't from Missouri. That's all I know. Interesting. An unorthodox genealogy. But that's it interesting because he looked like a human what is he so i wonder if all the songs that they're playing are songs all that right, was on his second mixtape because we know that he listened to that first one on repeat and then at the end oh i think i was right because at the end of the last movie he opened that sorry if it seemed like i was flirting with the high priestess i wasn't mm, weren't you though pretty sure he was gamora is not the one for you first met my beloved at a war rally. Everyone in the village. <laughs> we should listen to him. I like him. You just need to find a woman who is pathetic. I didn't like that. <laughs> you left me there while you stole that stone for yourself. And yet here you stand, a hero. I will be free of these shackles soon enough and I will kill you. This is weird. We've got a sovereign fleet approaching from the rear. Why would they do that? Probably because Rocket stole some of their batteries. Dude, you saw how that high priestess talked down to us. Now I'm teaching her a lesson. Oh, I didn't realize your motivation was altruism. I'm gonna kill some guys. All those ships are remotely piloted. Oh, you know, that's funny. Because I was just about to say it's like a video game. That's really cool, actually. Bye. The intent to kill. Oh man. That is rough because they're risking like nothing besides their ships. Quill, to make it through that, you'd have to be the greatest pilot in the universe. Lucky for us. Aye, aye. <laughs> Rocket's funny. Dude, seriously. Hey, let me. And that sister is really just in it for the vibe. <gasps> okay, good. Somebody has Groot. I was scared about that. Whoa, that's wild. It really is like he's playing a video game. It's not ripe. Yeah, they're not ripe yet. We already said that. I'm getting nervous about her. Hopefully she's not gonna think about anything. Get him! Get him, Drax! I'm so scared for you. He's just out in the open. Oh my god. Someone what? destroyed all our ships! Who did that? What is that? Who cares? That's the jump point! Go! Go! It's a guy. Who? Don't tell me. Could that be his dad? I only guess oh because still out I mean we painted about <laughs> who his dad is twice now. Jesus! Somebody get drags back in. Thank you, Gamora. Oh, somebody get Gamora and Drax back in. Prepare for a really bad oh my god. How is Drax alive after that? He's getting hit by so many trees. How is that possible? that field how do you fly with what's between your ears instead of what's between your legs because he stole annulac's batteries they're called harbulary batteries <laughs> no, <they're not. laughs> that's funny like this a little one inch man saved us well, if he got closer, <laughs> i'm sure he'd be much larger yeah and that's on eyesight in perspective someone follows you through the jump point it's a little man it's a little so one inch man you'll need my help i'm not a fool Navi. i bet it's a one inch man yeah, me and Drax, we're so similar. We basically look the same, too. Is... After all these years, I've found you. Oh, is it really his dad? Also, who's that ant woman? My name is Ego. And 
I'm your dad. <gasps> I knew it. This is so exciting. Oh my gosh, I'm so curious about him. Also, I feel like it's very telling that his name is Ego. Like, is that supposed to give him us insight as to what kind of person he is? It's our old boss. Yandu. Okay. I don't really remember most of these people's names, to be honest. Dakar. Oh. I thought I recognized him for a second. It's been some time. Oh man. Dakar. So I'm getting the vibe that Yandu is very alone. You can go to hell. Very not good. You betrayed the code. Ravagers don't deal in kids. You may dress like us, but you'll never hear the horns of freedom when you die, Yandu. And the colors of a gourd will never lash over your grave. So, Yandu obviously made some very poor choices. Seems he's going soft. If he's so soft, why are you whispering? Ooh. For him? You know I'm right, Craig. Is there going to be like a rebellion against him? <laughs> I wish I had people to roll out a carpet for me wherever I went. That is so much. You know, but realistic. They run out of carpet sometimes. How did they run out at the perfect moment, though? What if Yandu took like 10 steps backwards? I have a proposition for you. I hired Yandu to pick you up, but instead of returning you, Yandu kept you. We've been together this whole time. You thought Yandu was my actual blood relative? You look exactly alike. What? It's blue! <laughs> Just like how me and Jax look alike. Let's say we head out there right now. Your associates are welcome. Even that triangle faced monkey there. I promise you. It's unlike any other place. Oh, Rocket, I like your triangle face. Finally get to be the father I've always wanted to be. I think this seems all fine and dandy, but I am very suspicious of him. I'm not buying it. Let's go take a walk. I am Mantis. Oh. <laughs> I hear it is the thing to do to make people like you. You know, she's trying her best at a smile, and that's all that matters. <laughs> Jax has such a laugh. <laughs> David Hasselhoff? It's not a magic boat, a talking car. What? Child, oh, that's funny. I had no idea what she was talking about. The other children that he was your father, but that he was out of town. I hate that story. It's so sad. What if this man is your Hasselhoff? If he ends up being evil, we'll just kill him. Okay. Yeah, I mean, she has a good point. Like, we should try to see what he's about, but, you know, be careful about it. It'll be just a couple of days. Oh. We'll be back before Rocket's finished fixing No, shit. Groot should come with us. Please. Hope Daddy isn't as big of a dick as you, orphan boy. What is your goal here? To get everybody to hate you? Because it's working. <laughs> Such a weird door. Your antenna, what are they for? Their purpose? Yes. Cool and I have a bet. Ugh. You're not supposed to say that. They have something to do with my empathic abilities. What are those? Hmm. If I touch someone, I can feel their feelings. That's pretty cool. I like her. I like Mantis a lot. You feel love. Aww. Romantic. Sexual love. No, no I don't. <laughs> no. Oop. That is not- She outed him! Must be so embarrassed! Oh my god, Jax, please. Do me! Do me! Do me! That's funny. <laughs> do her! Aww. And the only thing you're gonna feel is a broken jaw. Is it because she's bottling up her feelings? I can make a stubborn person compliant. Oh, it interesting. To help my master sleep. That makes me kind of nervous for what Ego uses her for, potentially. Especially how she said it makes a stubborn person compliant. I don't know if I'm being too suspicious, but certainly there's got to be a problem in this movie. Oh my, there is a lot of them. 
Okay. Ew. Did you not eat before this? You should have. Oh, nice. <gasps> Poor Groot. Uh. They chose the right person to stay home. This is good. <laughs> Oh my god, that's funny. So tough now without all your toys, are you? Now I'm scared. <laughs> Crap. <laughs> oh, I forgot about those arrows that he has. There's too many of them. He needs my help. You need to get me out of <gasps> Poor Groot. They are going to kill him. Poor baby Groot. He has to make a tough decision. We ain't stupid enough to help kill the Guardians of the Galaxy. Oh. Oh, dang no, the court be on us. Okay. That ain't right. You protect him like none of the rest of us much matter. Mm. Oh, man. This is chaotic. And I feel kind of bad for Yondu. Whoa. Okay, girly. Oh. She finally got that root. It's not even ripe. It's not ripe. I, yeah, that's what we've been saying. Is she gonna be their new captain? This place is so weird on the inside. Ego's planet. Hey, those plants look like what he planted on Earth. Welcome, everyone, to my world. Hmm. Wow. You have your own planet? And it does look beautiful, but there's got to be something up. There's something fishy for sure. All that glitters is in gold. <laughs> Although that's pretty cool. This feels like what's the catch situation, you know? When you're getting everything good in real life and you're like, okay, but what's the catch? I'm what's called a celestial sweetheart. A celestial like a god? Hmm. Small G, son. So he's a god. Wow. I think we might have got a, bit, a hint of that in volume one because that sounds that. familiar. Is that his brain? Layer by layer. Whoa. The very planet you walk on now. Whoa. So. But I wanted more. Is his human form just made from him? Detail. <gasps> that was him. Did you make a penis? Oh. Dude. What is wrong with if you? If he's a planet. How could he make a baby with your mother? <laughs> it would smush her. I, I... That's some stuff that we don't need to know all the time. Okay, so he did make up his body. That's actually pretty interesting. When did you meet my mother? Not long after. Aww. It was with Meredith that I first experienced love. Aww. That's sweet. I've searched for you for so long. And when I heard of a man from Earth who held an infinity stone in his hand without dying. Hmm. That does I make knew sense you now. Must be the son of the woman I love. If you loved her, why did you leave her? Good question. We need to find out why that happened. This is mutiny! I was right. It is mutiny. Oh my god. Okay, that's terrifying and actually really sad and scary. Dang. That's kind of awful. How are they choosing these people to throw out? Oh, so it's like kind of random for the people that agreed with him. I'm stupid! Mmm, how's he feeling? He's like, this might be too far. You know what would be a really kick-ass name? Taser face! <laughs> <laughs> That's how I hear you in my head! Rocket, why are you doing this when you're tied up, though? Dying is certainly better than having Ew, not as drool spit. Shit, that is disgusting. Taser face is a cool name. I'm not as easy a mark as an old man without his magic stick or a talking woodland beast. I want 10% of the take. And a couple more things. Location of Ego's planet in the nav. We'll wire you the 10% once we've paid. The child my father would have Gamora and me battle one another in training. The time my sister prevailed, 
My father would replace a piece of me with machinery. Whoa. Again and again. Oh my again, god. Never once refraining. That's awful. Oh, that's so sweet. I told everyone my father was from the stars. She had brain cancer, so everyone thought she was delusional. Why didn't you come mm. back? Why didn't you send Yondu, a criminal of all people, to come? Yeah, good question, too. I couldn't stand to set foot on an earth where she wasn't living. I had to watch her die. He was there. So he's being a little bit selfish, or at least not understanding what it really is to be human. Close your eyes and concentrate. Ooh. Take your brain to the center of this planet. Is he gonna be able to control stuff like him too? Uh, yes! Yes! Whoa! Whoa! Yes. Yeah. yeah! Whoa! <laughs> Into Feel what? <gasps> yes. That is crazy. <gasps> Wait, this is sweet. He's playing catch with his dad. Who doesn't love that? I used to play catch with my dad all the time. So you're a pet. I suppose. Yeah, it kind of seems that way. Why do you go on such a hideous one? Okay. I am hideous. Drax, you what? Horrifying. Drax, she's so cute. What do you mean? Beautiful people never know. How to okay, her you. eyes are kind of yeah. terrifying. Then I'm certainly grateful to be ugly. She is not ugly though. <laughs> There's something I must tell you. What is it? <gasps> Mantis, stop. We need to know. What were you about to say to Drax before I walked out? Nothing. Come on, Mantis. I really want to know. It's something to do with ego, isn't it? Hey, what about this little plant? Can I smash it with a rock? <gasps> no, Chef. It's too adorable to kill. Okay, thank you. I was a Cree battle slave for 20 years, went to Carfing. He offered me a place with the Ravagers. Me and Stakara, the other captains. We weren't so different from you and your friends. The only family I ever had. Where's Quill? Yeah, he went off with his old man. Ego? Yeah. Why didn't you deliver Quill the Ego like you promised? Yeah. Does Yondu know something? Could fit into places we couldn't. Could fit deep in. Okay, so that's always what he told him. But there's more, isn't there? Oh. <laughs> Stop. What's going on? No. How dare they? Somebody kill all these people. How dare they? My poor baby Groot. Hey, twin. Look at him. That makes me actually so sad. Hey, you want to help us get out of here? Oh, it makes me so sad. There's something I need you to get and bring back to me. Oh, I'm so nervous for him. That's my underwear. <laughs> Just brings back a bear tidy whitey. Can somebody draw him a picture? That's Vorker's eye. We need differentiation in our teaching. Groot. That's a desk. Groot, please. this big. He doesn't know how big Groot? Whose toes that? And let's just Groot, what discussed. happened? This is sending me. This is so funny. Groot, I don't know if you need to be over here. I'm kind of nervous. Oh, okay. He, he gets it now. It's like a blues clue. I'm pretty sure that's how blues clues worked. Oh gosh, I'm so nervous. He's right behind him. That ain't it. Oh, Groot. Little baby Groot. He is helping. He knew they went too good. far. They killed all my friends. That's sad. <laughs> Dang, that one is huge. I just don't remember it being that huge. <laughs> the arrows are cool, and it's like satisfying the way that he whistles. <laughs> Yeah, that was, that was cool. What if you couldn't whistle? Can you still control the fin or no? Like, I can whistle, but it's not that good. <laughs> Let's 
go Groot. Trip him. Bully him. But only a little bit. We still have to be the bigger Groot. Oh, that's cool. That is smart for him to be able to control it from there. <laughs> He's just going nuts. Ugh, rude. <gasps> then we gotta get it out of here now. Now would be like a really good time for tasers to shoot out of his face, I bet. Who is this? I am sending you the coordinates for Yondu's ship. Release the quad! I can't taser face. Is she gonna laugh? Yep. <laughs> Oh, that's funny. Guardians of the Galaxy is so silly. There's these moments where they can make fun of themselves. It's like that would never happen in like Captain America. Like they do make jokes, but it's never like that. It ain't healthy for a mammalian body to hop more than 50 jumps at a time. We're about oh, okay. to do 700. <laughs> oh, poor Groot. Dance with me. See, she certainly got feelings for him, but she's just so hard shelled. When are we gonna do something about this unspoken thing between us? A guy and a girl on a TV show dig each other but never say it because if they do, the ratings would go down, sort of. <laughs> what we should be discussing right now is something about this place. It doesn't feel right. What are you talking yes, about? Yes, thank you. What we should be discussing right now is something about this place. It doesn't feel right. What are you talking yes, about? Yes, thank you. You made me come here. And Earth, Earth is the place where my mother died in front of me. No, it's because that place was real, and this is a fantasy. This is real. I'm only half human. I finally found my family. Don't you understand that? I thought you already had. Hmm. Chosen family is just as important, sometimes more important than blood family. Um. Oh, God. Oh. Man, you're doing all this the Ego's planet? I can't imagine he'll be happy about that. Oh god. How can she lift that? <laughs> that is huge. Alright. Hopefully that was taken care of. At least a little bit. Good lord. They have quite the complicated sister relationship. No. <laughs> I was unaware that we were watching The Exorcist. Why is she doing that? She literally had you beat already. Can you just call it right now? She didn't have to help you out of the ship. When I bested you in combat. No, I saved your life. Yeah, literally, she pulled you out. And who wanted to win? And I just wanted a sister. Ooh, whoa. Oh, that actually makes me really sad for her. And my brain from my skull. And my arm from my body. Her brain? Because of you. That's so terrible. I mean, obviously, her, her eye and arm is terrible too, but her brain? looking glass oh we know it we saw Favorite that in the beginning world. scene yes yeah it was this history calls upon great men and sometimes we are deprived the pleasures of mortals i'm immortal he's immortal mm -hmm. really yes long as the light exists that's wild that's like huge huge but you know peter it is a tremendous responsibility only we can remake the universe it's interesting that he says remake. Sounds like he has some sort of Come with me. Big idea. Mantis doesn't like what's happening. Oh, I'm imagining being with you. <laughs> Drax, that's not Drax, don't, like don't be right mean. Now. I'm not Drax anymore. You are in danger. What is that? Everything is temporary. Mm. We are 
forever. That's why he was able to leave Meredith. He was disconnected. I have found meaning. What is he being shown? Is that I like... Hmm. Okay. Oh my god. Okay. Oh, okay. No, that's concerning. Is that how he's immortal? By taking lives? That feeds his life? Because that's like at the root of his planet, which is how he lives. Cora was so rudely interrupted Stanley! Man, I always get nervous that I'm not gonna spot him. So I like movies when it's obvious like that. What the hell you doing, boy? I wanna save Quill so I can prove I'm better than him. I can lord this over him forever. I know you play like you're the meanest and the hardest, but actually you're the most scared of all. Shut up. My own damn parents who sold yeah. me. Go, little baby. That's slavery. why he can relate to Rocket. Who you are, boy? Because because you're me. Mm -hmm. And now they hug, or at least fist bump. What kind of a pair are we? <laughs> okay, they're not to the hugging stage. It's very understandable. They're in their healing arc. God, he's in the caverns. Who are they? You are scared. Yes, girly, I am scared. Help us. The expansion. It is my purpose. I implanted thousands of extensions of myself on oh, thousands of worlds. That's what it was. Covering all that exists until everything is me. Wow. Yeah, I don't like that. Single celestial doesn't have enough power for such an enterprise. But two celestials. Is that why he had a son? Bodies are his children. I had Yondu deliver some of them to me. It broke the Ravager code, but I compensated him generously, and to ease his conscience, I said <gasps> I hurt them. Oh my god, this is awful. No wonder Yondu doesn't like him. Only you carry the connection to the light. We need to find Peter now and get off this damn planet. Ego will have won him to his side by now. We're, We're family. family. I knew that line was happening. No one behind. Oh my god, Ohana means family. Lilo and Stitch. Oh, okay. Well, and his friends. See, that's the mortal in you, Peter. We are beyond such things. Is he like brainwashing him? You said you loved my mother. Yeah, that's what I'm confused and about I too. It seems like you were canoodling with a bunch I of other Lily, people. And I knew if I returned to Forest Blood, I'd never leave. So I did what I had to do. It broke my heart to put that tumor in her head. No. No freaking way. What? No. Yeah, kill him. But he's the planet, so he's not gonna die, and he's immortal. You kidding me? Why did he have to do that to her? Do you think you are? You killed my mother! I wanted to do this together! But I suppose you'll have to learn by spending the next thousand years as a battery! Oh, whoa. Bro, I can't believe he gave her the tumor for why. Why did he need to do that? Why did she need to die? So that he wouldn't be tempted to return to Earth? That's incredibly selfish. Oh, don't you touch that mixtape. My life, my love. How dare you? I hate this. He's about to be a god with a capital G, I believe. He first said lowercase g? I think it's more than that now. Not the Dairy Queen. Is that why they close all around me? Hey there, jackass! Let's go, Yon. <laughs> Could have killed us all. Uh, thank you, Rocket. We had it under control. We did not. That is only an extension of his true self. Mm -hmm. He's the entire planet. How do we kill a celestial? There's a center to him. His brain, his soul, whatever it is. Is that what they saw or is it somewhere else? <laughs> Yondu is our chosen man. <laughs> oh, see, I knew it. Well, I knew there was a different reason. Mother, kids. I wasn't just going to hand you over. Well, of course I have issues. <laughs> That's my freaking <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that makes sense. So a 
saving the galaxy again? I guess. Too. We don't need you right now. We're literally dealing with the Celestial already. Guys, like they're on Pelotons or something. <laughs> it's almost like that one Black Mirror episode. You try to teach me how to control the power. So could you? A little. I made a ball. A ball. <laughs> is he gonna save the day with those kind of powers? Also, is he gonna have to kill his father? That is very heavy. That's Ego's core. That ore is thick, Rocket. I got it covered. Drill into the center, we kill him! Okay. So he seems pretty down to kill his dad. <laughs> but maybe when he gets the actual point, it might hit him. We could actually really use their help on this. chain reaction throughout his entire nervous system meaning mm. what the entire planet will explode oh god is he Coming. yep that was my guess Didn't you say you could make him sleep he's on his way when he wants make him go nine nine read a good bedtime story quick <laughs> you know i'm not a parent but i imagine a lot of parents feel like that sometimes <laughs> You're doing good, sweetheart. You're doing great. And our fat butts ain't gonna fit through those tiny holes. Well... <gasps> Groot! Get your cute little roots over here. All right. First you flick this switch, then oh, this man. switch. That act I don't know how well Groot's gonna be able to pull all these directions, given don't how long it took him to find the fin, and he didn't even do that. that will set off the bomb immediately, and we'll all be dead. Look at his little eyes. He's not absorbing anything. No! Now that's the button that will kill everyone! Try again. That's so funny. That is the button you're supposed to push. Point to it. No! Oh, crew, hey, it's the other one. You have priceless <laughs> batteries and an atomic bomb in your bag. If oh, anybody's gonna have Groot's to going. You, he said, exactly I'm ready. Coach is putting me in now. <laughs> Groot the absolute oh, maniac. He gives me Baby Yoda chopper vibes. Guardians. Perhaps it will provide you solace that your deaths are not without hurts. This is gonna hurt! Promises, promises. Oh my god. Okay, that was crazy. Is her hand okay? No, no, Loser! We're gonna fall. No. It's okay, he's immortal as long as the planet's alive, right? Where's our baby Groot? Oh. Mantis, look out! <laughs> oh god, Groot, now's your time to shine. You got this. Oh. What? Gamora? Can Nebula go get her? Will's got different things to do right now. Yep, I knew it. What kind of father would I be to let you make this choice? Ooh. Cool, Rocket. Yeah, that was cool. He's got to tap into his powers with his feelings. Oh no. Come on, dude. It's all you. Nice. Good job. This is so much pressure. That's the core. Oh no, that's just him. Can you stop doing the whole skeleton to body thing? It's really giving me the yuck. Come on, it's all quill. <gasps> no, little baby crew. He can't cry. I'll cry. 
His purpose is to destroy you. My personal opinion. Doesn't need to be like this, Peter. Why are you destroying our chance? Oh, that's what sad. What greater meaning can life possibly have to offer? Love or something? I don't know. Don't use my head to fly the arrow, boy. Yes. Your feelings. Oh. This is so sweet. And Fleetwood Mac should play for this. You shouldn't have killed my mom and squished my Walkman. I just can't. That part actually almost made me cry. Just thinking about how he literally gave his mom a tumor. That is so awful. You got it, Groot. Oh, gross. It looks like a brain. Groot's a little scared right now. And honestly, me too. Which button? Come on, girl. <laughs> you can... Oh, God. Let's go. You need to take care of the twig. Not no. without you. Yeah. I ain't done nothing right my whole damn life, rat. You need to give me this. What? He wants to go out this way? Yondu. Oh, I see. He is waiting for Quill. To the frickin guardians of the galaxy. <laughs> Only he didn't use Aww. Oh my god, what a potty mouth. Potty mouth grew. We're gonna need to have a real discussion about your That's life. what I'm saying, Rocket. <laughs> <laughs> I was wondering why he was yellow. <laughs> he made himself into Batman. That's funny. Rocket. He's still doing his Rocket, best. Look at me. Where is he? Not leaving without him. I can only afford to lose one friend today. That's so sad. But obviously, Rocket is doing the thing that he thinks is best. Meanwhile, Craglin or whatever his name is, he's like, oh, also, where's Yondu? If you kill me, you'll be just like everybody else. Dude, you've killed What's so many. So yeah, and also, what is wrong with that? Whoa. You know, I like kinetic sand videos. I usually think they're satisfying. That was not very satisfying. That was weird and creepy. Yondu! So, the man that gave us life and the man that raised us. But he wasn't your daddy. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. He said that just in different words. Right. That's sweet. What? But he doesn't have a space suit. Oh, that's sad. He's losing both of his dads, isn't he? Don't do what are you doing? You can't. No, wait. That's really sad. No! Oh, that's so sad. Oh, no! <laughs> that actually makes me want to cry a little bit. Dang, the grief that he's gonna have to go through. Lost his father and his dad within a minute of each other. <sighs> that's, that's a lot for me right now. And now he's just floating in space. That was on the ship. Is this for Yondu? Oh, and I think that was Peter's. Both Yondu and David Hasselhoff went on kick-ass adventures and hooked up with hot women. And fart robots. I guess David Hasselhoff did kind of end up being my dad after all. Aww. I had a pretty cool dad. Sometimes that thing you're searching for your whole life, it's right there by your side all along. True. You don't even know it. Gamora, does that bring anything for you? Nebula. I was concerned with staying alive until the next day, every day. And I never considered what Thanos was doing to you. I'm trying to make it right. You will always be my sister. That's sweet. What is that? Like a fancy cremation? Captain found this for you in a junker shop. Said you'd come back to the fold someday. It's called a zoom. It's what everybody's listening <gasps> to on Earth nowadays. It's got Let's go. songs on it. Three. 300 songs? 300 songs? We're loaded now. Rocket, grab the pieces and reassemble them. I 
think Jan would want you to have. Oh. Thanks, Captain. Captain? Might as well if we're half god be captain while we're at it. <laughs> Please give an earbud to him. Please Root is so cute. That's your fault, got me. I am old, but I'm happy. I sent word to Yandu's old ravager buddies and told them what he did. Aww. That's so nice. Especially since things were like rough there at the end for him. Aww. That's sweet. He didn't let us and down even him. No, he did not. No. Oh, I wish Yandu <laughs> could be alive to see really that, though. That's oh, sad. Rip. I was always mean. No. Oh. And he stole batteries he didn't need. <laughs> like you, Rocket. Take it slowly. You're still young. That's your fault. If you want. It's an unspoken thing. But now it's a bit spoken, you could say. And so are you. <gasps> Drax! I saw that on coming. Oh, on the inside. What an interesting dynamic they have. What a good movie. I'm excited for him to use that weapon. I really like that weapon. So I'm happy it'll still be around. Oh! He could have killed someone like that, so that's not great. Better work on that, maybe in an empty place. <laughs> but I think he'd be proud knowing that we're back as a team. I'm in. Dope. These seem like some interesting folk. What say we still some shit? All right, so we're gonna see more of them, maybe. Certainly, she's mad. High Priestess, the council is waiting. They are perturbed. I've she looks for quite hours. undone. Of destroying the guardians of the galaxy. Mm. Oh my. Adam. Adam. Interesting. Like Adam and Eve? Seriously? You can't stay <laughs> up here long. It's a complete mess. <gasps> I am good. He's a teenager You're now. You're boring. He's going through his teen phase. <laughs> now I know how Yandu felt. I didn't know that he would grow that fast. Jesus, hey, wait, how many cutscenes does this one hey, have? Supposed to be my lift home. There's Stanley though, so it's worth it. Eyes. Oh, gee. <laughs> okay, that was great. Friends, thank you so much for watching Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2 with me. I loved it. It's been a little while since I've seen Volume 1, and I know I enjoyed that, but I definitely liked this movie more. It was just so much more intense. I really liked the concept behind Peter finding his dad, finding out who he is, and finding out what he did while tragic. It was really interesting to watch unfold. And of course, I loved Groot. I loved Drax. I loved being introduced to Mantis. I think she's a great character. And yeah, I, I feel super happy with this movie. I thoroughly enjoyed every part of it. I am really curious of when we're going to see them next, because I don't think there's a volume three movie out yet, but I wonder if they'll appear in like any of the Avengers movies or anything like that, because so far we haven't had any crossover with them. Maybe that'll happen. I don't really know how Marvel works with that just yet but who knows who knows either way again thank you so much for watching with me till I see you in the next video I hope you stay hydrated stretch your legs please don't get arrested and I will see you then goodbye